new hair. Isn't it so beautiful? <laughs> Just kidding, it's obviously a wig. As you know, I posted a video only a few days ago with really dark brown hair and short brown hair, so unless this is a miracle, it is 100% fake. So sorry if I fooled anyone. But if I did follow you, that's good, because then that means it looks realistic. So I am ill, so I do have to apologise, but um, I wanted to show you my new hair. Um, I was very recently contacted by Uniwix, um, who offered to send me a product to review. Um, the website itself has sort of hair extensions, accessories, uh, wigs, but they do like human and synthetic, and then all of the subcategories involved in that. Um, but I thought, wow, I've got so many hair extensions, um, hair pieces aren't really too good because of my hair length. Um, so maybe let's just go for a wig, because I actually don't own any wigs. And this is the one that I chose, which is that stand up, which I think is rather beautiful. So let's just discuss the website itself. So the website is... It looks really professional. It's modern and it's easy to navigate around. Now, um, the only thing I sort of stupidly was confused on is when you're looking for um, a certain wig, I thought, because um, it sort of shows you a picture and of like a coloured wig, I thought that it was only that colour that you could pick. Um, which is stupid, so I went straight for like the coppery one and was like, oh yeah, copper hair. Um, and then realised that it actually comes in a load of different colours. But I do really like the style of this one um, with the short bangs. And I've literally just tied these back a little bit because um, it's getting rather sweaty. <laughs> now let's just go into the subcategories I mentioned earlier. I'll read them out because I'm not entirely sure what I'm talking about when it comes to wigs. So there is lace front, traditional monofilament, silk top, full lace front, glueless and capless. So a lot of that means absolutely nothing to me, but it might do to you. Um, so if you wanna go and check out all the different types of things, if you already know what they mean, then feel free to head to the website, which will be linked in the description box. This wig you see here is a traditional. It just means that the cap in it um, is traditional, which is great because that means it's easy to put on and easy for me to understand as a complete wig virgin. So this wig you see me wearing right now is called the Leslie wig, in case you want to go and buy it. Um, it was $34.49, which when converted is £20.27p, which is pretty good. I mean, in the past I've bought wigs off eBay for around the same price and they've got here and I've just been like, ew, ew. And they've just, they've like, looked nothing like this. Like, to me, I think this looks quite realistic. Um, the ones that I've had look very, they don't look like real hair. Like, from what I can see, this looks like real hair. Um, they look very plasticky, um, but this is heat friendly fibres, so obviously you're not going to be able to completely blast it in heat, but I'm sure you could straighten it out a bit if you really wanted to, but I haven't actually done anything but brush this, um, and I think it, it's got a nice little curl, nice movement to it. So as I said, I went straight for copper, and just to give you a better look, it's kind of like an auburn colour, but it has loads of different tones in here, which makes it absolutely gorgeous. I bet this is not doing it justice whatsoever, but it's beautiful. And if you are after this one on the website, it is called LT7. That's the colour code for it, in case you're wondering. Okay, so let's talk about the shipping. Um, if you live in the US, which I know a lot of my subscribers do, then this is fine for you because it's just normal shipping. Um, it only really starts to get expensive if, if you want like express shipping. Um, which you don't need, really. Um, however, if you live internationally, it is going to cost you just under £20 to ship, which is just a little bit less than the price of this wig. Um, I suppose it depends on how much you want the wig. I don't personally feel like I could comment on it because I don't know um, where you could get wigs elsewhere um, and the standard. But I mean, each to their own, you might have to make your own opinion up on that one, but um, even still, £40 altogether for a complete new hairdo, which I think looks convincing. You'll have to let me know what you guys think. I don't think that's bad at all. Now, if you are in the US, as I said, free shipping is 
for you. That doesn't make sense. You get free shipping if you live in the US if you spend over $49, which I'm sure could be easily done if you're female and it's just like, add to basket, add to basket, add to basket. Oh, I don't really need it, add to basket. <laughs> we can do it just fine. Um, however, just so you know, they are shipped from Asia, so it took about a month to get to England. Um, so, I mean, if you want it straight away, you're not going to get it. Like, I always order, like, hair extensions from China and things like that, and you just have to be prepared to wait for it. So it could take anything up to, like, a month. But just zoom you out to show you a better look at the packaging. This is how the wig came. And there is the brand on there, Uni Wigs. Um, it's quite professional packaging, and you have the little scan thing. Um, so if you have a smartphone, you can just scan that, go straight to the website. They have details of their Facebook and YouTube channels on there. Um, I love the fact that sort of hair things come in a box because it just saves them from getting damaged. It gives you somewhere to store it and I think as a company it's a much better choice. Even if it does cost a little bit more for postage, I think it's worth it to protect um, the product that you spent so much money on. Now what you do get in the box is a wig cap which I was really happy about because I thought oh no I'm gonna get this wig and then have to supply my own bloody wig cap so I can't wear it straight away but how wrong was I? So I think it's quite courteous that they um, included this and it was just like it wasn't the black one that you see here it was um, like a a beige, if you ever bought beige tights, it's like that kind of colour. There is also the care instructions which came attached to the wig. Um, and again, here is the information of the style and the colour. Um, always handy to have. And then as I opened it, this wig was sort of in here. So as you put it back, I suggest just keeping these just to keep the hair all nice and together. So my verdict of the actual wig, I do really like it. Um, I was really impressed. I just sort of had um, a misconception of wigs looking quite cheap and fake and nasty. Um, but today I have been proved wrong and I am really impressed, especially for the price, considering years ago I paid that much for crappy ones on eBay. What I am going to do is take these um, bobby pins out so you can see what it looks like properly and I gotta be quick because I feel like I'm dying I'm so sweaty <laughs> there you go you can see all out and lovely I personally really like it um and I think I would actually go out in public in this if I'm having a really shitty hair day or if I'm being really lazy if I'm ill like now when I just when I feel pretty I might put it on around the house <laughs> but um no I do really like it and I'm quite tempted to go this colour in the future, maybe as my hair gets longer, but um, just want to say a massive thank you to Uniwigs for sending me this wig. Um, again, I apologise for the ill voice, it's probably very annoying, um, but I will uh, post all of Uniwigs social networking sites down below, um, so you can go ahead and check them out. Also, I'll enter the details, sort of the free shipping, and you can get 10% off your first order with the coupon REG10. Um, but again, I'll put it down below just to make sure I said that right. <laughs> so that's all from me today. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget, links to my Facebook, Instagram and Tumblr are down below. If you want to come over and follow me, that would be awesome. Apart from that, I will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.